this, but uh, try not to get pushed in while wearing it. That's a good chance. These I don't mind about. The shirt was custom built in German Street. Well, you didn't have to go to all that trouble. Uh, all part of the service. Didn't exactly leap out of the water. You know how you came to the end? Yeah, I think I ran into King Kong out there somewhere. That's a pretty good punch. Yes, he does. That he does. I'm glad you were there. We'll be embarking in an hour or so. I'd like to know what you were doing on this boat before you went swimming. He's not one of your gorillas, is he? Better make it sound good, McGill. Well, I just have this thing for small boats. I just love one. I assume he was after my papers. Well, there's a question as to who they really belong to. But not to you. Not to you either, friend. Called your boss a little while back. Told him about the competition I'm having from the Albanians. That's true. No, he doesn't believe it. He says that there's a Professor Leros who's one of the world's outstanding oceanographers. This happens to be Albanian. So what? So they need his research about, like, the Atlantic needs salt. I told him I'd look into it. You can call the police if you want to. You have searched him. I left the fountain pen lying around. What's that? You left something else lying around, too. I used to have one of these when I worked for American Intelligence. Standard issue, federal patent. Now, what kind of dummy are you leaving this laying around? I'll only warn you this once, McGill. Listen, somebody tried to kill me tonight, and I'm just wondering how much you had to do with it. As much as I could. Yeah, I figured that. I know your background, McGill. You wore the same coat six years ago, and you weren't bounced for dependability. Now, if you're short of a buck or two to get back where you came from, I can spare a thousand. You really are a dummy, aren't you? How much do you know? Listen, I don't want to know anything about you. I don't care what you're doing. Nothing. I just don't care. I'm interested in Coulson's papers, and I want to know if I can buy them. You were supposed to stow these, and you weren't supposed to let anyone in here. I couldn't let him drown. I would have. You noted our sailing dates. I'm not blind, dummy. And you've concluded? I've concluded nothing. You concluded that on one of these odd dates, one of us will be going ashore up here off Durazzo in northern Albania. Then I don't want to hear about it. You're deep in the confidential file already. Well, Jimmy. stop putting me there. Now listen, I'm only here to buy your papers. Then make sure you don't wind up a long way short of middle age in the Adriatic. He may have failed tonight. He? What do you mean, he? You're an American citizen, McGill, even if only just. The guy who nearly had you drowned and will try again is at the hotel. Our Albanian friend. Rudnik. That's right. But you've set him up. I tried, pal. I tried as hard as I could. Wrong dates, wrong place. Everything he has is wrong. Except Professor Liras. Uh, he won't connect it. But what about Rudnik? He'll probably compare wrong information with McGill. I'll kill him. Better him than us. <laughs> 